Enemy Sutherlands, probably two of them will reach you in 23 seconds. Shoot them through the wall. This is sick! This guy is fucking badass. One, fire! Through the wall, let's go. That's how you fuck him up. That's how you fuck him up. Lancelot, it's a gun dog. No choice, I've got to get out of here. He's coming for that ass. God damn! Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today we're gonna do episode two of Cold Geass. In the last episode, we literally see Lelouch touch grass and gain the power to kill people by telling them to kill themselves. I'm just kidding. Uh, he touched some girl that was in like this green canister that was supposed to be poison that the king described it as, but it was, I think it was the heir to the real kingdom because they kind of mentioned how uh, we can't let her get out because then they know that I'm not really the heir or some shit like that. So I think she's like the real heir. I don't know what happened, but it looks like she granted him the power to kill people. Uh, just by saying you're dead. I think it's something tied to the bloodline of Britannia. That's what I think it is. This is just the second episode. This is what I like extrapolated from watching it. We literally saw Area 11, Area 11, which is Japan, be colonized or taken over by Britannia, which they showed as the U.S., but maybe there's like some other European countries, but the U.S. is there. So my country is really the shit country. <laughs> It is, but, no, I'm just kidding, but um, besides all that, I mean, that's all fun and games, but they literally, like the commanders of Britannia are just killing people in slums, shooting up grandkids and grandmas and grandpas like it's nothing. You see kids yelling, you see a baby, you hear a baby cry in the background and get shot. Like, that's fucking insane. I think Lelouch gets out of this and hopefully he goes to school and act like nothing happens. But if it's a high-tech society, they might catch him on some kind of cameras. Hopefully not. Hopefully he can get out of this. But I think one of his motivation is because he was in Japan that was taken over in 2010. And now it's 2017. So he's probably 17. He still holds a lot of hate for that. But now he has this new power granted by that lady in green. So he might be able to do something about it. I think the only way we can find that out is if we jump into this next episode. So yeah, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. And without further ado, we're just going to jump right in. Pew, pew. Oh, all these people are dead. Get the fuck out of there. What is he wanted me to do? Why did you give me this bizarre power? Get out of there. <laughs> they got mechs coming in. I think these are nightmares too, or maybe another version of it. Like one lone man. How could all these royal guards be dead? Look at, look at badass and shit. He don't even have nothing. What happened here, boy? Oh, she's gonna shoot at this guy. I order you to come out. At once! Oh shit, he- Who the hell do you think you are to order me? It only works with direct eye contact. My name is Alan Spacer. Nobility. Alan Spacer? My card's in my breast pocket. After you confirm who I am, I'll request your protection. <laughs> nice. Keep your hands up in the air. Hand your nightmare over to me. Did it work? Understood. Got it. How the fuck? She's gonna wake up and like, what the hell happened? <laughs> Nigga, go! So are we having a bad day? <laughs> Looks like you missed a chance to go to heaven. Wait a minute, he's alive. Thank God. This is what saved your life, Mr. Suzaku. You're lucky it was under your protective suit because that's what deflected the bullet. What's the latest on the situation? Yeah. It looks like the poison gas was released. Massive 11 casualties have been reported. Damn, they used that. They haven't that. caught the perpetrators yet. How much experience do you have in piloting a nightmare frame? Well, there's no way an 11 would be made a night. Well, supposing you could. Wait, is that him? No, that's not him. Oh, damn, damn it! Coming! Don't worry, I'll be, I'll be with them. Get the people out of here. Damn. Damn. Yeah, that's not true, but... Nigga in a fucking mobile suit. If you keep cutting class, you'll get held back. Are you near a TV? Huh? To what? The news. Is there anything about Shinjuku? Yeah. Hey, there's nope. nothing on. Traffic restrictions? Why is it restricted? Yes, you're making them think. Once they finish everything off, they'll release news that favors the military. By the way, tell my little sister that I'm going to be home late tonight, would you? Oh, why does he always hang up on me like that? I'm hemmed in here, and it'll be tough to break through by myself. Yeah, what are you gonna do? I want payback for being dragged into your fight. Just 30 minutes left. The west entrance. Use the tracks to move to the west entrance. Who's this? If you want to win, you're just gonna have to trust me. To win? Alright, let's go. I I'm already liking this, but what the fuck is going on, man? What am I supposed to do now? You pathetic 11. If you simply run away, this hunt hasn't much to offer in the way of sport. Jump onto the train! Gotcha! 
<laughs> okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. You, go after the Glasgow. Yes, my lord. What the? Nice. Oh, shit. Shot by friendly fire? What's your name and your unit? We're after the one on the Yeah, terrorists got your shit. And he's fucking you up. Nice. He's gonna eject? Oh, he's smart. I would shoot that guy. Don't let him live. But how did you get a hold of the Sutherland? What? He's gone. Where did he go? Wow! How did he know? There's this guy is okay. What the fuck? In ten minutes, I'll contact you with your next instructions. This dude's a badass now. He's this like wearing me out. Point. He won. Can you move? Two. Can't you tell us who you are? What if these signals are being intercepted? Enemy Sutherlands, probably two of them will reach you in 23 seconds. Shoot them through the wall. Nah, he's out of his mind. Everyone, double check your weapons. This is sick. This guy is fucking badass. Tell Lasso squad to go straight in. Real chess game. I hope he's right. Two, one, fire! Through the wall, let's go. That's how you fuck him up. That's how you fuck him up. So Yugen and Sir Valerie both lost. An ID signal can be a double-edged sword. Besides, if the terrorists follow the orders I issue, my task at hand is sure to be completed. You heard him. Do what the voice says. Yeah, what else does he want us to do? Hey, five, ready? Get yeah. your ass in that thing and let's go. Yeah, they're using the same word. Yeah, kill them before they realize. This means terrorists have our military weaponry? Yeah. Okay, all right, all right, all right. We've no time for this right now. I wouldn't walk Two, like that. Fire anchor. See, this is gonna be unexpected. Now then, the enemy has five options. There, man. That's a more stupid move than I expected. You, mission number three now. Concentrate our forces there. Surround them. The enemy's main force is that center dot. All right. Let's see how smart this guy is. What? Where's the enemy? With this, I call check. They all gonna fall down and, and blow up? Yep. All right. Okay, that's smart. They're gonna lose traction. Yep. Yep. <laughs> My plan worked, didn't it? My lord, please be so kind as to call it Lancelot. Okay, we got a new weapon in attack. And they said once this is released, that guy who's the pilot, his life will change forever. You scored at the top of the class in the simulator. About what you told me earlier. The new system is not outfitted with an ejection mechanism. Okay, I understand. So if he fucks up, he's dead. I want to see what it looks like. Does it look tight? The advanced weapon developed by us in the advanced special arms. That looks pretty cool to me. Lancelot. It's a gun dog. Let's go. Up. Oh. Activate ME boost. <laughs> yeah, what is this shit? Boom! Alright, so this is the ace right here. No one is expecting this. I mean, he got shot. Oh, fuck, no, fuck. No! The resistance! This is B group reporting enemy presence. Status. Everyone ejected, but they took out four units and nothing flat. Enemy numbers? Just one. one. I think it's a new model. Get the hell out of there. What's happening out there? Damn. It's like double up. It reflects bullets? This is what happens when you depend so much. So called terrorists. Uh huh. Alright, he's raw with that shit. Gotcha. How do you know which is good and which bad? Damn. They just fucking them all up. Now, they are probably not. Dead, yeah. Okay, never forget. He ejected. What happened? Oh. Look at that shit. Right through the fucking. No, I kind of like that guy. Look. He's dead. Can it really be only one unit? Loose is the one unit. Uh oh. Fuck. That's what I didn't want. That's what I. Did. Maybe you can stop him. Oh shit! He blocked it. Are you the guy that's in command? Yes, I'm like Loose. Damn it. No choice. I've got to get out of here. He's coming for that ass. God damn! Alright, just like that. Okay, alright. Hey, I'm returning the favor! Get the hell out of there. I mean, hers is way too old. Ran out of both arms. That's true. Oh, he's on it! He's like, fuck that. Doing that and, okay, you can get more power. Come on. Be a hero. Thank God, get the hell out of there, little God, get the fuck out of there. Oh, they're gonna find out this guy is not really Britannia. 
Are you tired? <laughs> Is this like the new like Please let me keep going. Devon Delian guy? Stop there! This is Prince Clovis's personal transport. At last, now I'd like you to let me pass. Yes, sir. Damn, he is going a little too crazy in this shit. Come on. Okay, I'm glad he's alive. This is what happens when you oppose the Britannians. How many people were killed because of this? Shut up! Do you know how many of us were killed or captured, do you? Fuck. Shit. Prepare to fire! This is bad. Cease fire at once! I, Clovis, hereby command you! All forces are ordered to cease fire at once! In the name he of Clovis La Britannia, you are hereby ordered! I shall allow no further fighting! He did are it. You satisfied? Well done. He did it. And what shall we do now? It's a nice game of chess. That has a familiar ring. Hmm. The two of us used to play chess together as boys. What? Remember? You. He did it's have been a, a long time. A pass to this guy. Brother. Big brother? Lelouch be Britannia at your service. But I that thought I was dead? You were wrong. What the fuck is going on? I have returned, your highness. And I've come back to change everything. Hey, well that was the end of episode two of Code Geass. Long story short, that episode was packed with a lot of action. We had the new nightmares versus this one nightmare that was special... One nightmare that's the seventh generation, and that nightmare is piloted by Lelouch's friend from when he was a kid. Now, he's able to take this special scientific, like the newly developed beta nightmare seventh generation and pretty much make quick work of all of Lelouch's plans. And of course, I kind of knew this was going to happen because Lelouch can see everything on the board, but when a new element is added to the board, especially one that you're not, and even he said it, it's the human element or whatever, like it's going to fuck up everything. Now that thing was super fast, super tactical, but there's one thing that, but it does have one flaw, the pilot, and the pilot does have a conscience. So where there was someone falling from a broken skyscraper, he was able to catch it and Lelouch was able to escape. Now this is only episode two and Lelouch got some background that I don't even know what's going on. It kind of seemed towards the end that he was actually really related to the prince that's in the Britannia, but I'm not exactly sure if that's his relation or some kind of like orphanage shit that he did because they played chess and they thought he was dead, but he's not dead. Um, but throughout the battle, before all that happened towards the end, there was, I mean, it was a lot of like commotion going around, a lot of like action. Um, I'm glad, I don't think anyone died, or I think very few died of the refugees, but I do think a lot did escape with, with their little escape hatches. Now, I was saying earlier, hey, why don't you just shoot the people that are escaping? But I think actually in real war, real life war, if someone pulls the eject button, it's not really honorable to shoot them as they fly down. They should like land on the ground. That's, I think that's how it is. Unless they do something heinous. Like I heard one more story where this, I guess this US guy who's going against somebody in World War II. And long story short, the guy in World War II, like he was shooting at people that were ejecting. So when he tore down his plane, he shot him when he ejected. And he said that's the only time he done that because he saw him picking at other people, so he did it. But I think it's like hands off. If someone ejects, you just let them fly out. You don't shoot them with your fucking helicopter or whatever, your airplane. But I could be making that shit up. I just heard that was how they did in World War II. I'm not sure if that's what they're doing here because a lot of people ejected and you know, you should just shoot them. I blow them up or follow them where they eject to and get them. But they didn't do that, so. And I like, I mean, and, and because of that, like, Lush was able to, like, take some plane. Well, of course, he got the super part where he can tell people what to do. But take some guy's guard outfit and go all the way up to the princess and tell him to call off the shooting and the killing and all of that. It's very crazy. I don't know what kind of power or what the limits to his power is. He does have, he is rolling 100 in persuasion because he's persuading everyone he talks to. Like, without any issues, which is kind of crazy to think about. He has no issues doing that. Yeah, but anyways, we're gonna jump right into the next episode. What I really wanna know is how those two are gonna interact once they figure figure out who each other is, like Lelouch and his friend, as well as that girl that he keeps throwing back to, the girl in the yellow hair who told him, who Lelouch told her to watch after his sister. Like, what kind of connection is that? And what role does she really play besides kind of being someone that he loves? But it looks like his love to get some kind of revenge on Britannia is definitely overshadowing all that. Because he got a little bit of power and he just went straight into war and protect, playing with his life like his chest. That's fucking insane! But this is an anime, so they just jump right into shit like that. But anyway guys, thank you guys for watching. Um, I really appreciate it. Until next time, I'll catch you guys later. Peace.